I have a 3DS XL and I need to get it modded for a customer. It's running 11.9.0-42 and it's a European console. I do not need to region change. So what I'm gonna do is search up, first of all, how I am supposed to mod it because I'm not really sure. I am usually just modding it with the MSET 9 method thingy. I have no clue what it's called because that's the newest version. But uh, let's see here, old 11.9. If it's gonna give me like some like super skitter hacks, I'm just gonna update it and then uh, yeah, that will be a lot easier. Yeah, that's a sloth browser. Yeah, so I'm just gonna update it. And yeah, after updating it, I'll be right back. And boom, it's updating. You know what? Let's just get the SD card ready. So I have a 16 gigabyte SD card that I'll be using for this. Put it into the SD card reader. Boom, there we go. We have some of the files, but I'm just gonna delete everything. Not worth trying to find out what's supposed to be there and what's not. Let's see here. Oh, I never made a backup, did I? Of the one I needed. Yeah, that's too bad. Then I guess I will just import it. Uh, 3DS, M set root and take everything from here onto the SD card. And come on there, buddy. And boom, it's done. Now I just need to plug this into my 3DS. And then just wait, I guess. Can't do anything else. Boom, it's now updated. Now I just need to go into me maker. Then I'll also have to go into settings because 75% of the time there's an thing that happens, no clue why, but uh, yeah. Let's see here. Let's just go into settings just so I don't have to go back and forth all the time. Now data management. Nintendo 3DS software. Was it extra data? Yeah, no, fine. This time it was good. Now, take out the SD card once again. Yes, I'm doing it while it's on. Plug it into the PC. It's here and then mset9.bat. All 3DS, perform sanity check. Are you kidding me? Why do you, why? Like, wh I don't get it. And now I had to do that again. The thing I just did, which was go into settings. Why do I have to do that? I don't get it. I just did it, but now I have to do it again. I guess it plants in some sort of file. It does not make sense, man. It does not make sense. Data management, Nintendo 3DS software, and now it's gonna do something, right? Yeah, what? I do not get it. I have no clue what it's doing. But yeah, close, then turn it off. And now I'm gonna have to run the mset9. mset9.bat. Yeah, there we go. Turn it off. Take out the SD card. Boom, boom, let's go, I'm set nine, one, one, boom, everything is fine. Now, do I even, yeah, I do need to have the SD card for this part. Okay, turn it on. Yeah, I think this is actually one of the fastest methods. Pretty sure it is. Let me just get some of my tea. Mm -hmm. Now I have to go into system settings. Data management. 
Nintendo 3DS, extra data, and then take out the SD card, plug it back into the PC. Boom. <clears throat> there we go. Now I'm set 9.bat1 and then inject. Inject, inject, inject. Come on, buddy. Boom. Uh, that is done. Take out the SD card once again. Put it in. <clears throat> and since I followed my tutorial perfectly, everything works as it should. If, by the way, if you crash here, that means your 3DS is already modded. If it says like, oh, bin 9, whatever, whatever, it's already modded. Boom, there we go. Start. Now I just need to remove the MSET 9 thingy. There we go. Turn it off. Take out the SD card. You know what, when it's modded, maybe I shouldn't take out the SD card like that. We'll see. If this breaks it, I'm wrong. If it doesn't, then I'm right, as always. Let's see here. There we go, I'm set 9.bat13. Boom, done. Take out the SD card. Now I just need to download all of the files. FBI, Homebrew, all of those apps. There we go, download play. Press those buttons, this is not a tutorial, so I can do whatever the fuck I want. Haha. <laughs> Boom. Don't need to say what I'm doing. I just do it because I'm good at it. There we go. Back in. This is going to launch Homebrew, if I didn't do it too fast. FBI, SD, CIAs, current directory, install and delete all CIAs, and yes. This is going to install HShop 2. I just do that for all of my customers now. So I don't have to download games for them and use my time. So yeah, HShop. And if they ask for help, I just direct them to my YouTube channel. So yeah, some, uh, some of the viewers that are viewing this might have bought something from me. Yeah, thank you for that. Humble Launcher. Universal, Universal Updater. I do not install Twilight though, because that you need to do something else. Not everyone wants to emulate DS games. Not everyone needs it. Oh, what is that? Nintendo video. Yeah, I don't care. Boom. Yeah, that's it. That's as easy as that. It is done. That's it. Thank you guys for watching. Like, dislike, subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Peace out.